Hello everyone! Uh, I'm sure you all remember a couple of months back you woke up one day and you realized the entire world was uh, talking about one thing. Uh, Google DeepMind's artificial intelligence uh, Alpha Zero. And you didn't, re you didn't really know what Alpha Zero was, or maybe you did, I, I, I for one didn't. Uh, but I, I saw that it uh, immediately crushed uh, one, one of the strongest engines, uh, chess engines in the world, uh, the Stockfish. And uh, of course this was all very interesting, but... Uh, uh, no one was really that impressed by uh, by the fact that Alpha Zero actually won that match, but uh, everyone was more impressed uh, by the fact how Alpha Zero won it, and the moves Alpha Zero made were uh, were so human, and they were they were a lot easier to understand for humans than, for example, uh, the one uh, the moves, uh, for example, an engine would make. Uh, but of course, even if you could understand the move, uh, there is a there is a there is a very a, a low chance that you would actually play it, as it's a very complicated move. Uh, so, uh, what's the idea here? The idea is um, after after that match, Alpha Zero versus Stockfish, uh, Alpha Zero sp stops playing chess. Uh, now Alpha Zero is probably solving some of the world's greatest problems, or or maybe it's um, evolving into Skynet. Who knows? Uh, but the world uh, saw that uh, there is a possibility for artificial intelligence to really play chess at a level that uh, that humans deserve. Uh, that chess is played. I mean. Um, uh, we need we need uh, we need someone that can play chess like Alpha Zero to teach us how to play like that. Uh, so uh, here we have Lila Chess Zero. Lila Chess Zero is also uh, an artificial intel intelligence. Uh, it's an open source project, uh, an attempt at computer learning. Uh, it will also uh, it she. Uh, I'm just going to refer to it as she. Uh, she's gonna learn her, uh, teach herself how to play chess uh, from scratch. So already, I believe she played a couple of million games, and uh, at the moment, I believe it's uh, it's maybe a, a four or five week project at the moment. So currently, her her playing strength uh, is around eighteen hundred, maybe nineteen nineteen hundred. And uh, this year, uh, I didn't change the design of my board. This is their website, the Alila Chess Zero. Uh, project website here I will turn off my uh, my frame so you can see it this is just part of the website I'm just using it to, to show you what uh, Leela can do and uh, here you can you can play against Leela in three modes in ultra fast mode in fast mode and in slow mode uh, but it's even better if you download Leela to your own computer install her and then uh, she will start learning and uh, uh, improve herself uh, because not everyone can afford a supercomputer like guys at DeepMind so Leela unfortunately has very limited resources so uh, the idea is um, every every one of us should install Leela on, on, your, on our PC and uh, with time uh, she will be playing games using our resource using our CPU and GPU and uh, those data will all merge into one into one huge chess entity at one point. So that's basically the idea. Uh, but I will put all the links in the description below. Uh, you can check out uh, uh, the website. You can check out uh, uh, the games Lila played so far. You can you can uh, go to this website and play against Lila. Uh, there will also be a link where you can install Lila on your own PC. Uh, with uh, I believe there there is a tutorial on how to do it. And, uh, you know, some general discussions on Reddit, uh, on their official forum and, and stuff. So, uh, let's try it out. I haven't installed her yet, but uh, I, will, I will install her uh, either, either today or tomorrow. And then I will probably make another video and c compare the strength uh, when, when, you, when she's installed on, on your own computer and when you play uh, over a website. So, here, uh, first we'll start with the ultra-fast mode. So, let's see the ultra-fast mode. Uh, and it's uh, interesting that uh, since it's an AI, it's not an engine, uh, if it plays uh, weak, it will play weak like a human. Uh, it's not going to be like fake weak moves, uh, like first you play a couple of moves extremely strong and then you uh, unpurposely blunder one. So let's see what uh, uh, what Leela, Leela Chess Zero can do. Okay, sorry about that. Yeah, it seems the interface shifted. Hope it's not going to do that every time I make a move. Okay, nah, I think it's alright. Uh, so since it's not an engine, since it's uh, like a self-learning AI, let's let's play against uh, Lila like we would against a human. So let's see, let's see what. Uh, okay, so Lila allows it. Let's go for knight captures on f7. And okay, that's uh, that's uh, pretty disappointing. But that's uh, probably one of the reasons uh, why you have to install her. Okay, but that was the ultra fast mode. Uh, let's try let's try the fast mode. Okay, let's restart game and uh, let's let's try the, the fast mode 
Uh, here she will have uh, a bit more time to think, and I don't think uh, she will. Uh, she will make a move like this uh, once again. Okay, let's let's try this. Captures, captures, and okay, let's let's go for it again. Queen of three. Ah, okay. King e6. Very nice. So de definitely something a human would do. Uh, I mean, a, a human wouldn't go for this variation, but uh, if, if you don't know the openings, you would definitely end up in this variation at one point. So, okay, I've never seen knight d4. Uh, I'm sure there's something very wrong with it, but uh, instead of trying to refute it, uh, let's uh, let's just see how how Lila how Lila plays the the end game. Okay, let's go here, check and. Uh, I guess let's just defend c2 and uh, castle probably go for f4 here okay what am I missing here I don't think I'm missing anything okay it's a bit tricky Is Leela tricking me? And G5. Oh. So this basically means uh, I just lost a piece, does it? Does it mean I just uh, lost uh, <laughs> lost a piece? Uh, well, I at least lost the exchange. So let's. Okay, I will. I will give up the exchange. Let's see how Leela will will play. So okay, definitely, definitely a lot stronger in in fast mode than in super fast mode. Okay, pushing those pawns, definitely, I like it. Didn't didn't expect uh, didn't expect her to be this strong uh, at this mode and so weak on that mode. That was very strange. Okay. Uh, okay, that's a, that's a really dumb bishop there. That's a really dumb bishop there. Okay. Okay, I don't want to go into the corner, but I don't really have a chance. Okay, threatening that. Let's just prevent it. And, uh, and try and get our knight into the game somehow. Rook e1 will be, will be a pretty big threat. Uh, okay, let's let's go here and hopefully hopefully do something. Uh, probably bishop c3 and yeah, okay. She saw that that was that was a pretty cheap shot. There's no really no real way to actually exchange here. Okay, and now rook against the bishop. Uh, let's see let's see uh, how she wins this. Uh, let's let's try and create some sort of a castle here. Okay, not interested. Not interested. Okay. Huh. Okay. Yeah, that was that was pretty bad. Huh. Okay, I will give her that guy. Okay. Okay, I will resign this since I didn't expect her to to play so well uh, after blundering that checkmate. Uh, so. Uh, let's just restart this and uh, use this mode again. Okay, let's see. Let's see how she'll play. How she'll play now? Uh, okay, let's let's repeat. Let's repeat and uh, and see. Okay, <laughs> uh, she'll go. She'll go for the same. Okay. So la laughing in my face. Let's go here. Okay, now I'm gonna take with the bishop and uh, and see what's what's the idea here. Well, this knight to d4 seems like a reasonable move, although I've never seen it. Running with the king, that's reasonable. 
Uh, let's let's get rid of this knight here. Hopefully as soon as possible. Okay. Uh, not really liking this bishop here. Not really liking it here. Uh, let's just attack the queen first. Okay. Not really enjoying myself here. Okay, captures, captures. Okay. Let's let's grab with the queen. Rook f8. Why not? Uh, let's get a rook into the game. Threaten rookie rookie four. Let's let's get it in there and uh, can I grab an a7? Then bishop captures an f3 is an idea. Bishop captures an f3. I can check here. Yeah, not really, not really all that great. Huh. Oh, that's actually not bad. Huh. Huh, huh. That's actually not bad. Okay, let's, let's see what you do on f4. Captures. Captures. Rook captures and uh, if I capture an a7 now, can I do that? Then after king moves, I don't really have any follow-ups. Okay, let's see, let's see. What she'll probably rook it to, yeah, I mean, uh, threatening checkmate. Uh, and after I block it, what do you play? That's what you play. Huh. Okay, I, I will take it. One takes. I block. Oh, I block and queen c1 check. Oh, I didn't actually want to play it, but I don't think uh, I actually had any, any choice there. Yeah, very nice. Okay. Finish me. All right, very nice. Got checkmated by by Lila Chess Zero. So uh, that's basically it. This is Lila, uh, and uh, like I said, in the description below there will be uh, all of the links uh, that you can use to uh, try out Lila on the website uh, using ultra fast mode. Uh, as you've seen, ultra ultra fast mode really gives uh, Lila too too little resources, so don't play ultra fast mode. Uh, you can use fast mode or, or even slow mode uh, where Leela will take some time to think about her moves. Uh, but they will definitely be interesting. So definitely not not um, not a move order and definitely not an opening. Uh, an engine would use uh, uh, any, any, any engine that uh, uh, has an opening database would never go for this variation with black. Uh, but as you've seen, Alila goes for it, and uh, I don't know, I've never seen that 94 move, probably, maybe if I try, <laughs> considered it uh, for a bit, uh, I would have uh, found uh, maybe even a refutation for it, but uh, uh, play, playing fast like this, uh, I don't know, Alila appears to be uh, a bit stronger than, than 1900, but, uh, you know, feel free to try around, uh, to try around uh, and do share some of your, some of your results uh, in the comment section. And uh, yeah, let's uh, let's all install her and let's create uh, let's create uh, another Alpha Zero, uh, so we can once again have a decent uh, Lila Zero chest this time versus Stockfish, and uh, where Stockfish can maybe uh, maybe play uh, the 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 last version of Stockfish on a on a really nice uh, piece of hardware. So yeah, uh, that's Lila Chess Zero. Uh, I do hope you enjoyed it. Uh, as usual, you can check two of my previous videos here. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you soon, uh, probably with another video from Grand K Chess Classic.